happy Tuesday. Hope you're having a good day. Um, today hasn't been too bad. I'm at work right now and the weather actually has turned around. It's 70 degrees right now. So it went from summertime weather at 83 to freezing cold at 38. Now it's back to, I guess, spring weather being 70 degrees. So it's just so crazy our weather here in West Virginia. It's like one day you're in boots and the next day you you can wear like a t-shirt and basically I could wear my summer shoes if I wanted to but anyhow today is Tuesday review day so I'm not for sure what we're gonna do but we will be doing something so see y'all later Bye. we're getting our Christmas tree up looks fair right now we haven't decorated it yet we just got it up we got our little thingy in front of the window from a little Marshall snowman and points out here's the lights with the music on our mantle decorated. Here's our little mugs for the eggnog from Christmas vacation and there's our eggnog. We've already drank some of it while we were getting the tree decorated. Yeah. yeah. Doesn't show up very good in the video mm -hmm. at all. Does no, it? it doesn't really. Here's some of our Christmas decorations. This is the only thing we've gotten out so far. It's pretty neat. We need to get more though because we got to get it. It goes up our chimney a little bit. But we need to get the inflatables out and the other things. It's Tuesday date night for me and Jeremy. And we are going to go see Incarnate. I think so. Yep. yep. It's about a little boy who gets possessed. And I know they tried doing an exorcism, I believe. Yeah. And it doesn't work. So they hire some guy to come in. And he can like get in the minds of killers and... I guess people and yeah. and um, so he tries to get the demon that way and I think a lot of other people gets possessed or something I'm not really sure but it looks, sure really, it looks really really good. good and anytime there's like a kid who's like a crazy killer person is always scary to me <laughs> um, but it's rated PG-13 which usually those movies seem to be scarier to me at least than rated R movies so we will see you at the movies from the movies and it was a really good movie I definitely recommend going to see it um, it's nothing that I'd really rush out to go see but um, I definitely probably go see it in the movie theater if you don't go see it in the movie theater then I would definitely rent it when it comes out on DVD but it's really good it's a different kind of movie um, it's by the directors of Insidious and that's what it reminded me of was Insidious quite a bit especially at the end of the movie but um, definitely would recommend seeing it so I'd probably give it four stars there are some parts that you jump you can jump out it's kind of scary but other than that it's not really like a really really scary scary movie but it's really good definitely recommend it and here's Jeremy with his review uh, I like the movie it um it wasn't blood, guts, and gore, and filthy lane. I mean, it did cuss a little bit in it, but it wasn't nothing too crazy. I thought it was pretty scary. I mean, I don't like that demon possessing, possession type stuff. Um, it freaks me out really bad for some reason, but I thought it was really good, uh, especially at the end, you know, a little twist there, kind of gets you confused for a second, but it was pretty good. If I have to rate it, I would probably give it 
I'd probably give it a four out of five. I liked it. Uh, I would recommend it. Yeah. Uh, I enjoyed it. Sounds good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, that's it for our Tuesday review. And I hope you, um, hope our advice helps you all whether or not to go see the movie. And let me know if you do go see it and whether you liked it or not. And I hope you all liked our Christmas decorations. We're still not completely finished with it. The inside's pretty much done. But anyhow, um, I'm going to go ahead and head off to bed. And we will talk to you all later. See you later. Bye.